I'm told we can see the new Air Force One let's now. Let's take a look. <laughs> We had the chance to fly with the president on board the world's most famous plane, Air Force One. George, take a look at this. Then at the White House, a surprise from the president. The first look at an updated aircraft, a new look for Air Force One that he designed himself. Here's your new Air Force One, and I'm doing that for other presidents, not for me. It's scheduled to arrive in 2024, the exterior getting a makeover with a new red, white, and blue paint scheme, a departure from the iconic blue and white. The current 4,000 square foot planes have been in service for nearly three decades with updates. They come equipped with armored windows, medical rooms, and offices for senior staff. We had different choices here. These are all slightly different. Is the frame still a 747 or It's not? a 747. But you know, it's a much bigger plane. It is, sir. Bigger wingspan, it's a much bigger wingspan. Some of the president's changes might be targeted by Democratic lawmakers. The House Armed Services Committee voted Wednesday to require oversight of changes to Air Force One's interior, fixtures, and paint. But that hasn't stopped the president from planning for new additions. In fact, we added things. And I got 1.6 billion off the price. Everyone wants to know, is there a pod or not? A pod? Seen the movie Air Force One? Yeah. Famous pod that flies out of the back. Oh, I see. But yeah, I know. <laughs> I could tell you there is a couple of there are a couple of secrets. You know what? There are a couple of secrets I don't think we're supposed to be talking about. So anyway, there it is if you want. That was actually a funny moment. You could see the pilots behind me. Don't say anything, no! Mr. President. He wasn't gonna say anything, but because there's so much secret, so many secrets on as that air. As there as should be. be. But uh, you know, the president is very interested in the subject, and as you saw the designs look pretty great. We'll see if Congress approves. And as he said, it's for the next president. We have a lot more with the president. Spent over two hours of interviews, so we're gonna roll that out over the weekend in a primetime special coming up. It depends on when the NBA finals finish. It's either gonna be <laughs> oh! Sunday night or Tuesday night, and that's coming up. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.